And once I do get a hand pinned, now it's a pretty easy thing to start your series of dilemmas, where from here I can come through and start to control my partner's hand. Now your partner has two choices. Number one, if he doesn't do anything, he always will surrender an underhook and now he can elevate his arm over his head. If on the other hand, he tries to strip my grips and bring his hand across and try to, tries to deal with taking my hands off, now he brings the elbow across the center line and he creates the dilemma of the underhook coming up or the elbow coming across where now I have back exposure. So I play a dilemma game with pinning and passing where I pin a hand down to the floor and if there's no reaction, I elevate it over the head. If he goes to address those grips before I can look to elevate it, he passes the elbow across the center line. Now I can strip it and now I can go into all of my favorite uh, back head and arm, seated head and arm and back attacks from here, okay? 